To the Gnat by Samuel Rogers, read for LibriVox.org by Anita Slusser. When by the greenwood side at summer eve, poetic visions charm my closing eye, and fairy scenes that fancy loves to weave shift to wild notes of sweetest minstrelsy, tis thine to range in busy quest of prey thy feathery antlers quivering with delight brush from my lids the hues of heaven away and all is solitude and all is night ah now thy barbed shaft relentless fly unsheathes its terrors in the sultry air no guardian sylph in golden panel pea lifts the broad shield and points the glittering spear now near and nearer rush thy whirring wings, thy dragon scales still wet with human gore. Hark thy shrill horn, its fearful larum flings. I wake in horror and dare sleep no more. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain. To the Net by Samuel Rogers, read for LibriVox.org by Alan Wayman. When by the greenwood side at summer eve poetic visions charm my closing eye, and fairy scenes that fancy loves to weave shift to wild notes of sweetest minstrelsy, tis thine to range in busy quest of prey, thy feathery antlers quivering with delight brush from my lids the hues of heaven away and all is solitude and all is night ah now thy barbed shaft relentless fly unsheathes its terrors in the sultry air no guardian sylph in golden panoply lifts the broad shield and points the glittering spear now near and nearer rush thy whirring wings thy dragon scales still wet with human gore hark thy shrill horn its fearful larum flings i wake in horror and dare sleep no more end of poem this recording is in the public domain To the Net by Samuel Rogers, read for LibriVox.org by Claudia Salto. When by the greenwood side at summer eve, poetic visions charm my closing eye, and fairy scenes that fancy loves to weave shift to wild notes of sweetest minstrelsy, tis thine to range in busy quest of prey thy feathery antlers quivering with delight brush from my lids the hues of heaven away and all is solitude and all is night ah now thy barb chaffed relentless fly unsheathed its terrors in the sultry air no guardian sylph in golden panoply lifts the broad shield and points the glittering spear now near and nearer rush thy whirring wings thine dragon scales still wet with human gore hark thy shrill horn its fearful larum flings i wake in horror and dare sleep no more End of poem. This recording is in the public domain. To the Nat by Samuel Rogers. Read for LibriVox.org by David Lawrence. When by the greenwood side at summer eve, poetic visions charm my closing eye, and fairy scenes that fancy loves to weave shift to wild notes. Of sweetest minstrelsy tis thine to range in busy quest of prey thy feathery antlers quivering with delight brush from my lids the hues of heaven away and all is solitude 
and all is night. Ah, now thy barbed shaft, relentless fly, unsheathes its terrors in the sultry air. No guardian sylph, in golden panoply, lifts the broad shield and points the glittering spear. Now near and nearer rush thy whirring wings, thy dragon scales still wet with human gore. Hark, thy shrill horn its fearful arm flings. I wake in horror and dare sleep no more. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain. To the Gnat by Samuel Rogers Read for LibriVox.org by Francis Brown When by the green woodside at summer eve Poetic visions charm my closing eye And fairy scenes that fancy loves to weave Shift to wild notes of sweetest minstrelsy Tis thine to range in busy quest of prey Thy feathery antlers quivering with delight Brush from thy lids the hues of heaven away, and all is solitude, and all is night. And now thy barbed shaft relentless fly, unsheaths its terrors in the sultry air. No guardian sylph, in gold panoply, lifts the broad shield and points the glittering spear. Now near and nearer rush thy whirring wings, Thy dragon scales still wet with human gore. Hark, thy shrill horn, its fearful larum flings. I wake in horror and dare sleep no more. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain. To the Nat by Samuel Rogers, read for LibriVox.org by Jason Mills. When by the green wood side, at summer eve, poetic visions charm my closing eye, and fairy scenes that fancy loves to weave shift to wild notes of sweetest minstrelsy, tis thine to range in busy quest of prey, thy feathery antlers quivering with delight brush from my lids the hues of heaven away and all is solitude and all is night ah now thy barbed shaft relentless fly unsheathes its terrors in the sultry air no guardian sylph in golden panoply lifts the broad shield and points the glittering spear now near and nearer rush thy whirring wings, thy dragon scale still wet with human gore. Hark, thy shrill horn its fearful larum flings. I wake in horror and dare sleep no more. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain. To the Gnat by Samuel Rogers, read for LibriVox.org by Janie Meisberger, Gikaba, Washington. When by the green wood side at summer eve poetic visions charm my closing eye, and fairy scenes that fancy loves to weave shift to wild notes of sweetest minstrelsy, tis thine to range in busy quest of prey, thy feathery antlers quivering with delight. Brush from my lids the hues of heaven away, And all is solitude, and all is night. Ah, now thy barbed shaft relentless fly, Unsheaths its terrors in the sultry air. No guardian sylph in golden panoply Lifts the broad shield and points the glittering spear. Now nearer and nearer rush thy whirring wings, Thy dragon scales still wet with human gore. Hark! Thy shrill horn its fearful larum flings. I wake in horror and dare sleep no more. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain. To the Gnat by Samuel Rogers. Read for LibriVox.org by Lynn Ray. May 20th, 2013. 
Las Cruces, New Mexico, USA. When by the greenwood side at summer eve, poetic visions charm my closing eye, and fairy scenes that fancy loves to weave shift to wild notes of sweetest minstrelsy. Tis thine to range in busy quest of prey, thy feathery antlers quivering with delight. Rush from my lids the hues of heaven away, and all is solitude, and all is night. On now thy barbed shaft relentless fly, unsheathes its terrors in the sultry air. No guardian sylph in golden panoply lifts the broad shield and points the glittering spear. Now near and nearer rush thy whirring wings, thy dragon scales still wet with human gore. Hark, thy shrill horn its fearful larum flings. I wake in horror and dare sleep no more. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain. To the Gnat by Samuel Rogers Read for LibriVox.org by Leonard Wilson of Springfield, Ohio When by the greenwood side at summer eve Poetic visions charm my closing eye And fairy scenes that fancy loves to weave Shift to wild notes of sweetest minstrelsy Tis thine to range in busy quest of prey, Thy feathery antlers quivering with delight, Brush from my lids the hues of heaven away, And all is solitude, and all is night. Ah, now thy barbed shaft, relentless fly, Unsheathes its terrors in the sultry air. No guardian sylph in golden panoply Lifts the broad shield and points the glittering spear. Now near and nearer rush thy whirring wings, Thy dragon scales still wet with human gore. Hark! thy shrill horn its fearful larum flings. I wake in horror and dare sleep no more. And a poem. This recording is in the public domain. To the Nat by Samuel Rogers. Read for LibriVox.org by Marion Carwin. When by the green woodside at summer eve, poetic visions charm my closing eye, and fairy scenes that fancy loves to weave. Shift to wild notes of sweetest minstrelsy. Tis thine to range in busy quest of prey, Thy feathery antlers quivering with delight. Brush from my lids the hues of heaven away, And all is solitude, and all is night. Ah, now thy barbed shaft relentless fly Unsheaths its terrors in the sultry air. No guardian sylph and golden panoply Lifts the broad shield and points the glittering spear. Now near and nearer rush thy whirring wings, Thy dragon scales still wet with human gore. Hark thy shrill horn its fearful larum flings. I wake in horror and dare sleep no more. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain. To the Gnat by Samuel Rogers Read for LibriVox.org by Paul Mazunder When, by the greenwood side, at summer eve, Poetic visions charm my closing eye, And fairy scenes that fancy loves to weave Shift to wild notes of sweetest minstrelsy, Tis thine to range in busy quest of prey, Thy feathery antlers quivering with delight, Brush from my lids the hues of heaven away, And all is solitude, and all is night. Ah, now thy barbed shaft, relentless fly, And sheathes its terrors in the sultry air. No guardian sylph, in golden panoply, Lifts the broad shield, and points the glittering spear. Now nearer and nearer rush thy whirring wings, Thy dragon scales still wet with human gore. Hark, thy shrill horn, 
its fearful larum flings, I wake in horror and dare sleep no more. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain. To the Gnat by Samuel Rogers Read for LibriVox.org by Richard McNamee When by the greenwood side at summer eve Poetic visions charm my closing eye And fairy scenes that fancy loves to weave Shift to wild notes of sweetest minstrelsy Tis thine to range in busy quest of prey Thy feathery antlers quivering with delight Brush from my lids the hues of heaven away, And all is solitude, and all is night. Ah, now thy barbed shaft, relentless fly, Unsheaths its terrors in the sultry air, No guardian sylph in golden panoply Lifts the broad shield and points the glittering spear. Now near and nearer rush thy whirring wings, Thy dragon scales still wet with human gore. Hark, thy shrill horn, its fearful larum flings. I wake in horror, and dare sleep no more. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain. To the Gnat by Samuel Rogers Read for LibriVox.org by Raven Notation 2013 RavenNotation.wordpress.com when by the green woodside at summer eve poetic visions charm my closing eye and fairy scenes that fancy loves to weave shift to wild notes of sweetest minstrelsy tis thine to range in busy quest of prey thy feathery antlers quivering with delight brush from my lids the hues of heaven away and all is solitude and all is night Ah, now thy barbed shaft, relentless fly, Unsheaths its terrors in the sultry air. No guardian sylph in golden panoply Lifts the broad shield and points the glittering spear. Now near and nearer rush thy whirring wings, Thy dragon scales still wet with human gore. Hark, thy shrill horn its fearful larum flings, I wake in horror, and dare sleep no more. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain. To the Net by Samuel Rogers Read for LibriVox.org by Ryoko When by the greenwood side at summer eve Poetic visions charm my closing eye, In fairy scenes that fancy loves to weave, Shift to wild notes of sweetest minstrelsy. Tis thine to range in busy quest of prey, Thy feathery antlers quivering with delight, Brush from my lids the hues of heaven away, And all is solitude, and all is night. And now thy barbed shaft relentless fly, And seethes its terrors in the sultry air. No guardian sylph in golden panoply Lifts the broad shield and points the glittering spear. Now near and nearer rush thy wearing wings, Thy dragon scales still wet with human gore. Hark thy shrill horn, its fearful larum flings. I wake in horror, and dare sleep no more. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain. To the Gnat by Samuel Rogers. Read for LibriVox.org by TechSavvy. www.techsavvy.wordpress.com when by the green wood side at summer eve poetic visions charm my closing eye and fairy scenes that fancy loves to be shift to wild notes of sweetest minstrelsy this thine to range in busy quest of prey 
thy feathery antlers quivering with delight. Brush from the lids the use of heaven away, and all is solitude and all is night. And thy barbed shaft, relentless fly, unsheaths its terrors in the sultry air. No guardian self in golden panoply lifts the broad shield and points the glittering spear. Now near and nearer rush thy varying wings, thy dragon scales still wet with human gore. Hark, thy shrill horn its fearful larum flings. I wake in horror and dare sleep no more. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain.